I've gone semi-viral, let's say, on Twitter a few times, maybe five or six times. I've actually done it where I've got over 400 likes on a tweet. You're gonna find out in this video that every time that that's happened to me, I've gained zero clients from every viral or semi-viral tweet that I've ever posted out. And what's interesting about it is that every engagement you get, all that does is give you a little bit of trust. That's literally all it does. When you click on my profile and you see 2,000 followers, it's not a lot of followers, but you're probably gonna come to me over somebody that's got 60 followers, let's say. But what actually trumps followers on Twitter, it's testimonials. Testimonials are the king if you're trying to become a freelance graphic designer. Because who are you gonna go to? You're gonna go to a guy who's got more followers or a guy who can prove that he gets results more than the guy who's got more followers. Because if you've got a testimonial where you've made a guy, let's say, five or 10K a month, that, that's ridiculously more uh, trustworthy than somebody just having 2,000 followers and is pixel pushing on, on Photoshop. And it's interesting because if you never give up, you can never fail. You'll always win if you never give up. Now, I don't care if you've got 60 followers. You need to get one client. Well, how, how do you get one client? You just start DMing people. It's that simple. Just start sending out direct messages to people offering your services. And don't make it really generic. A lot of people make it generic. It's a copy and paste job. It's clearly a copy and paste job. Actually speak about what they're interested in. If they're talking about, I don't know, garden. <laughs> Mention about how you actually could improve their garden services through brand identity. Call them by the first name. Don't just do a copy and paste. It never works. You get one client. You get one testimonial. On that testimonial, you talk about what you've achieved. After you've got what you've achieved, you push that testimonial out as much as you can. And after that, you're going to become more trustworthy. And you'll certainly become more trustworthy than the guy who's got 10,000 followers if you can prove why you're trustworthy. A follower count is just a number. And as I say, the moral of this story is, no matter if you go viral or semi-viral on Twitter, it's never really going to amount to clients. So get out there and start providing value to the bigger accounts or just to your clients in general. Get a testimonial and you'll do just fine.